So everybody knows when you have a girl and you spend a day with her, she decides how the day goes. She picks what you guys do for the whole day. And she that's picks, how it's supposed to be. They get princess treatment, isn't that right? Mm -hmm. But today we're gonna do things a little bit differently. Our day today is gonna be controlled completely by luck. We're gonna let these cards over here decide what we do throughout the whole entire day. It's not gonna be my choice, it's not gonna be her choice. It's gonna be up to these cards. So babe, are you down for that? Mm -hmm. I'm excited. So do me a favor, you go inside, hide somewhere, just go somewhere where you're not gonna see what is gonna be on these cards, okay? Okay, thank you, sir. Uh-huh. Okay, so in case some of you guys were a little bit confused by that intro, let me show you guys what I mean. So I'm gonna take two cards over here and uh, follow me. So check this out, it's early in the morning, me and Jasmine just woke up, so it's time for us to figure out how we're gonna start our day. So the two options we have for how we're gonna start today, one of them is gonna be coffee, and the other is gonna be smoothies. So what I'm gonna be doing, I'm gonna take these two cards. We could see coffee and smoothie, but I'm gonna show them to my girlfriend like this. She's not gonna be able to tell. I'm gonna have her blindly pick how we're gonna start our day, either with a coffee or a smoothie, and for for the sake of today for the sake of her love for me for the sake of our relationship i really pray to god that she picks the coffee because here let me put it this way i'm trying to say this in the nicest way my girl when she starts her day with a coffee she's amazing she's beautiful caring loving she's the nicest person in the world when she doesn't have her morning coffee um have you guys seen uh, the movie Halloween? Like you guys know Michael Myers? Or have you guys seen The Exorcist? Like you know, the devil? Yeah, my girl resembles a devil when she doesn't have her morning coffee. So yeah, for the sake of this relationship, let's just hope that she picks the coffee option. Babe, look, before you make your choice, mm -hmm. just please pick the right one because I really don't have the energy to deal with your <laughs> I don't crankiness. Know what you're talking about. I'm an angel. No, 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 you're an angel after you have something in the morning mm -hmm. when you don't have that thing you're you're cool okay. yeah so <laughs> no you're not cool but you want top or bottom mm, let's see which one is calling <gasps> yes thank <fucking> god <gasps> coffee coffee oh. okay <laughs> guys thank god no, you... i literally love coffee more than i love you i swear babe and i swear like you know how much you love the suns like i love coffee okay but honestly if i was hanging off a cliff and coffee was next to me also hanging off a I cliff would coffee. you would save the coffee yeah cool coffee will give me energy to save you okay but the second you take the coffee i'm gonna fall off the cliff okay babe whatever <laughs> let's just go get your coffee just pulled up babe now you're smiling now you're smiling. Let me see that smile. I'm so happy. Only one thing could cause that smile. Yeah, Starbucks only, that's it. Oh, I thought you were going to say me, no. but yeah, <laughs> Starbucks, yep. Uh-huh. And you know my order? You got to speak up. <laughs> Look. Do you know my order? <laughs> if you're a boyfriend, the least you could do for your girlfriend is know her Starbucks order. That's what's like, my Starbucks order? It's a tall, shaken, brown sugar, oat milk, espresso. It's so hard to that's remember. That's so hot. Like it's, those words that you say, that's honestly the hottest thing you've ever said to me in your life. Boyfriends, memorize your girl's Starbucks order, trust me. Okay, let's go. Mm. Do a tall brown sugar oat milk shake and espresso. Yeah. Okay, anything else? Get you a guy that knows your favorite. No, that'll do. I have your name. Um, Jasmine. <laughs> Okay guys, the beauty of Starbucks is not only do they serve coffee, they serve jokes. So the answer is on the back. We're not gonna look yet. What did the Easter egg ask for at the hair salon? What's your answer? Oh, Easter egg? What did the Easter egg ask for at the, let's A see how- A color change. A what? Color change. Before you answer, because you can dye Easter eggs. Hey, you always say that I'm dating a smart girl, right? Wait, Let's wait, see. Wait, no, you know, you guessed too. Okay, Let's I have see. a guess. Here, hold the camera. What did the Easter egg ask for at the hair salon? I say crack, because the Easter egg cracks. So crack. Should we check? Okay. Perfect. What did the Easter egg ask for at the hair salon? A new dye job. <gasps> See, I said that. I said a color change. Did you actually get it? You I cheated. Did. I on you... my life I didn't cheat. I told you I'm smart. You come to Starbucks every Not day. This you didn't. One. You didn't come across this joke. No. <laughs> so I'm dating a smart girl. <laughs> you should know the answer. It's yes. <gasps> wow. Okay. 
Thank you. This is my favorite drink. Order it if you want to try it. So I'm dating a smart girl, a beautiful girl. And now after this first sip, I'm dating a happy girl. What do you say? Happy what? Happy wife, happy life, right? <laughs> Honestly, yeah, that's true. Happy wife, happy life. And I am a happy wife. This is the best day ever. That's what Dennis says whenever I include him in the food videos. <laughs> Just as I was about to try my hot dog, a special guest spawned into this food video. You know I'm here for the food videos. No, whenever you include me, like to take me to Starbucks, oh. I'm just so happy. This really is the best day ever. Okay, babe, I have an idea. Okay, so I gave you the first two options of how our day is gonna start, coffee or smoothie. Mm -hmm. Now I want you to take the camera, you to take the cards, and you write two options for food, for where we're gonna eat, and then I'll pick it, yeah? We're reversing the roles, okay? Oh, I have to think. Yeah, you have to think. Right? Yeah, it's showing your chair too. Okay. <clears throat> it's on? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Wait, did you write it on yeah. the, this I side? I wrote or? it on the back. Good luck. You guys are about to be with Jasmine by yourself. I'm stepping out of the car. Good. Go. You guys, it's good luck. That's all I'm going to say. Oh, never mind. I'm not going to expose what? you. What? For what I'm about to kiss. Just go away. Guys, you want to you see me kiss myself? I have a pimple. No. And it's na I named it after him because this pimple is all the stress he causes me. So now I'm going to kiss myself. I just kissed myself. So hey, how crazy. dope is that? I have a pimple named after myself, bro. That's actually really sick. <laughs> no, I, it's not. Really? Because you caused me stress to get this pimple. <laughs> okay, well, guys, all the hair that I lose and all the wrinkles that I have on my face are all named oh, Jasmine. those were there before me. Guys. No. I'm choosing the food options. So his favorite thing is BJ's. So I'm going to have that be one option. He's taking a picture of <laughs> me. This is so funny. It's my girlfriend's first time being on camera by herself. And then my favorite place to go is Chick-fil-A, so I will have that be another option. Look, this is actually crazy. <laughs> so let's try it on the back. Oh my god, he's freaking recording. <laughs> Look, the camera's right there. My girl's right there. B, James. And then we're gonna do Chick-fil-A. I don't know what she's writing on the card, and I'm gonna have to pick what we do next for this video. I'm so happy I have coffee. Oh my god. Okay, let's call him into the car and see which one he picks. <laughs> I'm excited. The boyfriend is here. So I have two options. Okay. Okay, top or bottom? Um, I'm gonna go with <laughs> bottom. Okay. Chick fil A. Oh, Chick fil A. I, we actually get Chick fil A all the time. What was the other option? We did. Oh, BJ's. <laughs> I mean, this one would have probably felt better, but this one's gonna taste good. So, felt bad. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, actually, I wanna change it. I, I choose BJ's. But we can't do that on camera, though. <laughs> oh, the we restaurant can... BJ's. <laughs> oh, oh, in that case, nah, nah, I don't want the restaurant. Oh, music. you said it felt better like BJ. Yeah, like BJ would have felt. Okay, sorry. Is my channel family guys, friendly? Why? Like, why am I dating him? Okay, guys, so I guess we're going to Chick fil A. Ooh, what do you write then? Hey, she knows I have a thing for grandmas. I don't want to be a creep and record them, but I'll just give you guys a little sneak peek. Oh my. But there's two right there, and there's actually one walking over here. Oh my God. <sighs> I'm getting hot. <laughs> So, why am I dating him? Jasmine knows I do have a thing for grandmas. I love older ladies. They're just so. Ah! You uh, think that they would want to give some BJs right now at the yeah. same time? Oh, no. Oh, and then, never mind. That's nasty. I'm not going to say it. What? No, nah, I can't say it. <laughs> okay, close your ears. Close your ears and I'll say it. Wait, I want to hear. No, nah, close your ears. And don't watch this part of the video. When, okay. you, when I upload it, skip I'm this gonna part. I'm going to watch it. Close both ears and I'll okay. say it. Imagine when a grandma. Babe. Okay. When a grandma does it. They don't have teeth, so it's like gums. Babe, ah! so it's impossible for them to use teeth, so it won't hurt. It's like gums, so it would probably feel better. Guys, <laughs> you said blink if I need help. I blink. Isn't that true, though? I swear, because sometimes the teeth be too much, but this, you don't have to worry about that. Anyways, should we go to Chick-fil-A? Wait, how do you know about this well, teeth stuff? Obviously. <laughs> That's the only... <laughs> Exposed! Babe, you let's go to Chick-fil-A. <laughs> let's go to Chick-fil-A. It's time. 
I'm done with you. I'm scared. Hey, hey, we're gonna keep this clip rolling. <laughs> He's scared to turn off the camera. We're gonna keep this clip rolling because the second this camera turns off, <laughs> I'm gonna get a mouthful from her. I'm, yeah, I might get stabbed. Um, so we're gonna keep the camera rolling while we drive over to Chick-fil-A. Babe, don't turn it off. She's too shy to yell at me in front of the camera, so we're gonna keep it rolling. Um, I love you. Kiss? Nah. What? I won't use teeth, I'll kiss you with my lips. <laughs> I'm joking. See, I just made it work. <laughs> I made it work. She was getting over it. We were gonna go get Chick fil A. Okay, we're gonna cut the camera and I'm just gonna. I actually hate you. I'm gonna take you. my punishment. I'm gonna take my punishment, babe. Give me the camera. Give me the camera. Okay, babe, I know you already wanna kill me and like I'm not trying to make things worse, but oh we were about to leave the Chick fil A, but the grandmas are still standing there. I'm not trying to say anything, but. Okay, they... wait, can you actually like. You should go like. I wanna see if you got some riz. Okay, here, hold the okay, camera. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go see I wanna see if you got riz. Are you gonna get mad or no? No, I don't care. Okay. Let's see if he has the game. I was about to take off, but I just wanted to say that I love your bag and I love your scarf and I love that it matches with your boots. Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> this was, this was, oh my God. <laughs> no, no, it looks really good. Oh, and your bag matches your my scarf. Shoes. Okay, you guys are doing it right. Oh, you guys are doing it. You just oh. made our day. Thank you. I love your car. Yeah. Oh, thank you so much. I want one of those when I grow up. Yeah, why not? <laughs> well, thank you guys. I hope you have a good day. Yeah, you too. Yeah, yeah. You. Bye. Thank you. W Riz. W Riz. Do you see what I have to deal with? Hey. Rizzly Bear. Exactly. What did you say? I like your shoes and your shirt or what? Don't worry about it. I saw you pointed at her shoes and her shirt or Don't something. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Just know. From okay, now so on. When I see a. a Gilf, I'm gonna go flirt with him. You told me to go to that. Okay, you but, told me to go. Okay, but I'm I, gonna go. I'm gonna go flirt with a. I I knew you'd get mad. I knew you'd get mad, and you said, "No, babe, go. I don't care." But the second I go and you I'm see gonna, them smile I'm and gonna, hug me, I'm gonna flirt with a grandpa. Okay, hold on, guys. Listen, I have a request. From now on, I'm not Brandon. I'm not Browatis. I'm the Rizzly Bear, Browares. Okay, from now on, no, babe, I'm not. I'm sorry, I'm not gonna deal with this. I knew you'd get mad, so I said, "I'm not gonna go," and you said, "No, go. I don't care." And I went. And the second you see them smile and give me a hug and laugh, now you're mad. Well, they're getting a little too touchy. Why do they need a hug? Nah, I'm joking. That was nasty as hell. I don't even know why I did that. Bye. <laughs> she oh, waved bye. I know. <laughs> Everything just keeps getting worse. Okay, should, <laughs> should we go to Chick-fil-A now? Yeah, let's go. Let's hey, go. enjoy this video with Jasmine because she's probably never going to talk to me again after this video. So, um. That's true. Enjoy her while you can. and. Show her some love in the comments so she could stay with your boy, Brandon. You think I'm gonna stay? If they convince you in the comment section of why you should stay with me, then maybe, yeah. She'll be reading the comments in this video, so let her know why she should stay with me and not leave me after that interaction. I think I should. Stay? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> On to Chick-fil-A. Okay, guys, so we got our Chick-fil-A as promised. Babe, are you excited to eat? I'm just feeling very blessed, honestly. Blessed and grateful. Can you hold the camera? I don't want to say. So I'm feeling very blessed and grateful, not for the food that's in front of me. Of course I am very blessed for this too, but I'm feeling extra blessed right now that my girlfriend did not murder me after that interaction with the grandma. So um, <laughs> now it's time to eat. The day's not over. Okay, well then I'm feeling very blessed and grateful that at least before you kill me, you're letting me enjoy one last meal, mm -hmm. so. Yeah, thank you. I really, <laughs> I appreciate your um, generosity and how how uh, courteous you're being today. Okay, guys, since we love you, we want to tell you guys what our order is from Chick Fil A. I'll let you go first, babe. I call it the Jasmine special. Calls it the Jasmine special. Okay, so I like the nuggets. I get the nuggets. I get a fruit cup. Some days, you know, I'm feeling a little healthy, and then I always have to do Chick Fil A and ranch because I like to like have options. So like, I'm dating a girl who likes to have options. That's what you're yeah. telling me. Yeah. Okay. So I don't like to have all like Chick Fil A in my. Food. So I myself now or later you guys let me know in the comment section okay well guys before i show you the brandon special the jasmine special is the nuggets the fruit you're cup. repeating yourself again <laughs> i just explained this jasmine special yeah you threw me off with the whole i love options and different <laughs> men whatever Chick Why did I say anything you didn't say different men no okay we're good then <laughs> and the chick-fil-a sauce and ranch now for me before i get into what the brandon special is i would like to make a comment about the jasmine special because yeah. she's actually trying to fool you guys into thinking she this gets a fruit a cup i do so yes she does order a fruit cup however her boyfriend orders fries and her hand accidentally reaches into my fries and accidentally goes in her mouth so sometimes she doesn't order the fries but there's what's this... yours is mine and what's mine is mine yes yes she orders a fruit cup 
Erica, but the fries still end up in her stomach. So <laughs> anyways, now for the Brandon special. Okay. I get a Chick-fil-A sandwich, but I get no pickles because... You're crazy. The pickles are so good. I don't hate pickles, but I just prefer not to have them in there. So Chick-fil-A sandwich, no pickles, and then fries. Wait, and look at him. Can we look? I put him on having options too. He likes... He likes this combo. I'm not gonna lie. I never used to get Chick-fil-A and ranch until I started dating Jasmine. So she did put me on with these sauces. <laughs> yeah, and now I get these sauces, so yeah. Babe, somewhat. Oh, what's going on here? Oh, what a surprise. Miss Health Freak <laughs> with the fruit cup somehow accidentally reached her hand into the fry jar. This isn't a fry. What is it? Oh, it's, a, it's an apple shaped in Look, the fry. Look, I got it from the fruit. Oh, so you, oh fruit. yeah, yeah. No, you're right. Oh, so you're dipping the fruit, the grape, in the ranch. Uh-huh. Oh, nice. You look so hot. Guys, I love this outfit on him. Like, this is, like, one of my favorite. Thank you. You look really good. Thank you. You're, you're making me nervous. You're glowing. Ooh, you look so hot. Okay. Oh, shit. Babe, you're making me blush. No, you're I looking really hot right now. Guys, she's making me nervous and smile, so I can't be on camera right now. So we're flipping it on her no, until no, my no, smile no. goes away. <laughs> but I love you. I just have a tip to all the boyfriends out there. You know, earlier I said if you're a boyfriend, you gotta memorize your girl's Starbucks order. That's the least you could do. Mm -hmm. um, here's another tip for a boyfriend to make his girlfriend always happy. If you like your fries medium, order large. <laughs> if you like eight nuggets, order 12 because your girl is going to eat some of your food so what i've learned from being in a relationship for the last three months is always order one size more and it'll you know make you less pissed off when she starts stealing your food because you know that you only wanted a medium but you got a large so she's not really taking your food you know what i mean so it's Okay, you know what, babe? So, I actually enjoyed being the one to pick rather than having to think and actually write stuff. So, um, I'm gonna give these cards to you. So far today, we picked where we're gonna go for drinks, which was Starbucks. Then we picked where we're going to eat, which was Chick-fil-A. Now let's do something, let's do something different. We already did something with drinks and food. Let's do something like, I'm gonna let you pick. You take the cards and, and <laughs> think. See, the, the pros of having a girlfriend that's smart. I'm what? Smart. Okay, babe, I'm gonna step away and you gotta give us two options for what we're doing next in this video. Deal? Mm -hmm. I feel like I have a good one that everyone would want to see. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay, babe, you got the two options. Mm -hmm. Okay, you wanna grab the camera? Mm -hmm. Let me show them first what's behind it. Okay. <laughs> All right, I have two options here Kay. that we're gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna go with top. Okay. The top? Show furniture? Yeah. What was the other thing? Save for another video. Okay, no, no. I'm glad I picked this because you're right. People would want to see this, actually. Yeah, this is good. Okay. And uh, your house looks actually good that you have some stuff in it now. Okay, let's not spoil. Okay, guys. Long story short, everybody knows I bought a house a long time ago. It was completely empty. No furniture. But one thing. Something shipped in yesterday and I wasn't going to show <clears> anything. I was going to save everything for another video and just do a completed house tour when everything was done all the furniture was in but i think since i picked this we could go to the house and i'll show them the one piece of furniture that came in yet is that good mm -hmm. okay. you look hot <laughs> guys she's just staring at me like this i'm just like checking you out the entire time i'm looking at do you, you have a crush on me no it's beyond a crush are you sure yeah are you Ooh, obsessed you with... left a button open too is that oh, yeah. for me it was a little hint for you but you haven't got the hint yet <laughs> i got it now <laughs> Okay guys, so we have arrived to the house. Like I mentioned, I've had this house for so long and it's been completely empty, absolutely no furniture, but you guys could follow me and see the first piece of furniture that just came in. We just placed it and it looks so sick. But first, here's how it looked before. I bought this house a year ago and it is still completely empty. Look at this guys. Look at this house. There's no furniture in here. And now after we got some furniture in, look at this. Okay, so I'm sure you guys can see it right now. We got a freaking couch. We got a couch, bro. Finally. And a rug. Oh yeah, and a rug. It's so comfy. Look, babe, can you get a close up on this? So the rug we got, we decided to do like a dark charcoal color because the couch, if you guys see it up close, it's a lighter gray. So we decided to go with a darker rug just so the colors aren't too. So, okay, what's the word I'm looking for, babe? We went with a light gray couch. So we had to get a darker rug so that the colors don't collide. Collide, okay. <laughs> there was a lot of rugs that looked really nice, like beautiful designs, a lot of pattern. They looked cool, but, but it's hard to, it's hard to pick a rug because his floor is so like, 
There's busy. so much going on on the floor. Yeah, so like... So we needed a solid color rug. Exactly. Our- my floor, my tile is already so busy and there's so much going on with all the gray, black, and white that even though there was a lot of carpets that we love with really beautiful designs, we decided it would be better to get a more of a plain colored carpet just so, you know, the tile is already so busy so it just looks better like this. And I think the couch is a perfect color and um, these tables match the vibe, so... And guys, by the way, the couch might look a little short right now, like... Like, this side looks good. This side mm-hmm. is perfect. But then from here... From here too, if you see the rug, it goes out a little bit. So he's adding another piece right here. So if Yeah, you so we ordered another one of... Hold on, let me show you. We ordered another one of these pieces. <laughs> so we're going to put another big piece just like this right here. And that's going to move everything over. You know, it's going to move everything over. No, I'm not just trying to show off in front of my girlfriend that I have a little bit of muscle. I'm just, you know. So the couch is actually going to look a lot bigger and it's just going to make the living room look more complete because we're going to have another piece. But yeah, what do you guys think? Your guys' comments actually helped pick out this couch because I was pretty indecisive on what couch to get and I left it up to you guys in the comment section. So thank you guys for helping me out. Let me know what you guys think because you guys had an input on what couch I picked and I went with the one you guys love. So yeah, I think it looks beautiful. Ooh, we love a strong man. Usually I wouldn't be able to pick it up, but you love a what? A strong, smart, funny, handsome guy. <sighs> Say less. <laughs> Imagine my back is like broken right now. <laughs> it's a big deal, bro. This is my living room. And it actually looks so complete. This isn't just like a guest bedroom or like a random room in the house. This is the freaking family room, the living room. Like, imagine when I get married and we have kids. This is where our kids are going to be, like, is, sitting. Yeah, exactly. So this is actually a big deal. So I really want to know what you guys think. If you think we went with the right choice for the couch style, the couch color, the rug. Obviously, we're missing a coffee table. I still got to order a coffee table. It's going to go, obviously, in the middle right here. And uh, But yeah, like we said, I picked the card that said show the furniture for now. This is all we have for right now. And the house is obviously going to get more full and it's going to get more complete. But look at it from this side. Babe, I'll take it. Rate the comfiness. <gasps> Comfy. I love this couch. It feels like I'm like sitting in a cloud. It's and I so, like that it's so big. Yeah, it's like, I huge. I can't even touch the floor. Look, your, <laughs> your feet don't even touch the floor. No, literally. <laughs> I don't know if you're just fun size or if the couch is just so freaking big. That's what I love about it though. I don't know if you guys could tell from the oh, camera, but it's huge. It's really wide. Every seat is wide, but look at it. Hold on. Okay, look at it from this side. So here's how the entire family room looks after the couch has been added. Look at it with the entertainment center over there. You got the fireplace on the bottom, big 85 inch TV right in the middle. And what used to be an empty plain living room now has a sick ass couch with some sick ass end tables and a sick ass rug and i just can't wait to be sitting right here on this couch laying down watching the phoenix suns games over here watching reality tv hell no we're making a lot of progress and i just can't wait i'm so excited to show you guys what the finished house tour looks like i'll do a whole separate house tour video when this house is complete but for now you guys get to enjoy this even though like i mentioned my house is not complete it's not even close to being complete but just the small addition of this rug and this couch it's already starting to make this empty house feel a lot more homey my house is finally starting to feel like a cozy home i don't know it's finally starting to come together and i could actually picture myself living in here starting a family in here making youtube videos in this house instead of my parents house so yeah it's really coming together and i'm excited i'm excited to see all the progress Okay, babe, so we got our coffee, we ate our Chick-fil-A, we came back to the house, showed the furniture that came in. Now, we're not done. The day is still young, we still have some more time to let these cards control our day. So, before I write our options, I have a question for you. Mm -hmm. What's today? Thursday. Today is Thursday, but there's something more important. I'll give you a little hint. Padres game. Today is the Padres season opener. Baseball season starts today. You already know the Padres are going all the way. We're winning the World Series this year. Sorry, Dodger fans, I love you, but you've had your time. It's the Padres turn now. So babe, on these two cards, we're gonna have the choice. You know what, I I don't wanna spoil it. You just give me the camera. You go, um, maybe go to, go to Devin Booker. Go to Devin Booker. He's waiting for you right over there you could go by devin booker talk to him keep him company let devin booker know that he's winning a ring this year and i'm gonna go write the op- chill chill bro and i'm gonna go write the options and i'll be back okay 
Okay, guys, so I really want to go to the Padres game. Like, watching it on TV is cool, but I hope she doesn't pick this one because... This is the option that I would love for her to pick right here. So I'm going to watch the game regardless, but am I going to watch it on TV or... Are we gonna buy tickets and drive over to the baseball park and actually watch the game? That's gonna be up to my girlfriend on which one she picks. Fingers crossed, I really, really hope she picks this one because look at me, I'm already wearing my jersey. I'm ready for the game. Hopefully my girlfriend makes the right choice. Okay, so we're gonna watch the Padres game regardless, but it's up to you if we're gonna be watching it at home on the TV mm -hmm. or if we're gonna be there live at the ballpark watching it mm -hmm. so you want top or bottom i'm gonna let you pick mm. Mm. sorry is that cheating <laughs> <laughs> top or bottom okay get tickets and go to the game thank god you picked that one so uh what time is it babe it's 4 30 if we actually want to get tickets and go to the game we need to we go need to go now we need to go okay okay guys so i guess we're going to the game and uh we gotta leave right now okay let's go i'm Are excited you, you're excited <gasps> our first together that's true it's our first <gasps> why do i want to cry <laughs> <laughs> well <laughs> Emotional. So I have a smart girlfriend, hot girlfriend, beautiful girlfriend, happy girlfriend, but a very emotional girlfriend. She's crying because we're going to our first <laughs> Padres game together. I'm just excited to create these memories with you. Okay, so we made it to the Padres game. Opening day, beautiful seats. Shout out to Stavi. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Babe, I told you I wasn't lying. We really got the game. Okay, let me see the jersey. Hold up, hold up. Let me move your hair. Whose jersey is that? My boyfriend. W girlfriend. She raised me up with this jersey. Are you having fun? Yeah, this was the best day ever. Why is every day the best day? I feel like every time we hang out, you say it's the I best know. day. I love you. Thank I love you. you too. Well, go Padres. We got a special guest here today too. Papa Rugs. Hey, are the Suns winning today? Oh, the Suns. The Suns? Yeah, we're uh, Yeah, yeah, they are. Yeah, we're playing right now. This is opening day for baseball, and I want everyone to remember this clip. Who's winning the World Series? Padres, baby, Santiago Padres, look at Padres. Padres. Um, Padres. Yeah. Hey, remember this clip. San Diego is winning the World Series this year. This year. We, Listen. We own the World Series. Yeah, we, hey, we got Soto, Machado, Tatis. On the pitching side, we got you, Darvish, Blake, Snell, Musgrove. And you got Papa Rex in the game. Watch the game. Yes, sir. Hey, this is our year. Padres World Series. Trust me. <laughs> But for real, we didn't really get engaged. We will in the future, but for now, we're just boyfriend and girlfriend. So I posted an Instagram picture, and my caption, I innocently put a heart like this, and then I put a wedding ring. Like, I was implying, you know, I love her. So wedding ring for the future. We went out to eat later, and this random guy comes up to us, and he's like, yo, congrats, you guys just got engaged? And I was like, and then my friend texts me, like, yo, what's up, bro? Congrats on your engagement. You're a married man now. So happy for you. And I'm like, bro, what? So I guess people... I mean, basically, technically, you're a married man. Yeah, technically, I'm a married man. Minus the ring and the proposal hasn't happened yet. But you know what I mean? So I guess based off my Instagram caption, people got the impression that I was married. She said it was a good thing. Why? So girls know he's... Okay. Um, for everybody wondering, it was an innocent Instagram caption. We're not engaged. We're not engaged. Maybe in the future, you guys will see a video. What? In the future, not maybe. In the future, you guys will see a video of me with a wedding ring proposing to her. But for right now, it was just me being cute and innocent on Instagram with a caption of a wedding ring implying that I love her. I love you too. I'm going to kiss myself now. <laughs> 
Okay, guys, we got runners on second and third. Let's score. Oh, oh, go, 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 go! No, he's out. He's out. Fuck. Son of the Ireland, bro. You gotta be a little quicker than that, Manny. Every night before we go to sleep, she goes in your theater and okay, takes kids. every night. Yeah. She... I know that's that. I see all of them back out of 24 packs. What did you think it was, a rat? It's exposed my girlfriend day. What did you think it was, the dogs eating the candy? I don't know, that you or Dennis. No, it was her. It's her. Okay. It's one of my favorite candy. All right, I'll, I'll do a refill for now. Are you nervous? I hate you. Guys, she's nervous on my you. dad. <laughs> I'm building a bond between you and my dad. You already have the bond with my mom. Oh, Jasmine, what are you doing? Yeah, this is good oh, for you. Thank, thank you. you. That's so sweet. Okay, okay, you can marry her now. <laughs> Wait, okay. I love your I mom more than I love you, I swear. I know you do. <laughs> so you have a good bond with my mom. You're not scared of my oh mom? Oh my god, no. She, okay. I literally, she's like my best friend. So you're scared of my dad? Well, it's okay. It's, I'm not scared of him. He just like makes me like nervous. Like, how do I know if he likes me or not? Okay, ask him. Ask him. Ask him, ask him what? If he likes me. Okay. <laughs> Wait, no, I'm scared. So we gotta build the bond. Are you ready to build it? Don't say something Dad. Stupid. Don't say something stupid. Can you come here real quick? Don't what? say something stupid. Are you nervous, babe? No. <laughs> okay, so Jasmine wants to know, do you like her? Oh my god! She's dating your son, it's an important question. Do I have to answer now when I'm under the influence? <laughs> well, yeah, because that's when the truth comes out, so yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. I, I like her. Why? Why do you like her? Uh, brother, let's go. I, I can answer right now. You can ask those questions at the game. My dad's drunk. <laughs> but, okay, yes, what? Yes, I am. I had yes, I am. one extra. But you like Jasmine? Yes, I do. <laughs> do you like it? Do you like uh, it? Do you Just like a it? Bit. You know, Just a little bit. It's not like I'm dating her and she's my girlfriend or anything. But yeah, I like her a little bit, you know? <laughs> okay, hey, we're building the bond with you and my dad. Okay, I feel like a little bit less awkward now. <laughs> Wait, what is my mom to you in Spanish? My suegra. And what is my dad? Suegro. Suegro. Dad. It <laughs> <laughs> started off with a little bond, now sitting next to each other in the car. She eat all my candy. <laughs> oh. No, that wasn't me, I swear, that was him. Oh, Dad. Just like how you thought I drank all the vodka, yeah. that was him too. No, I was gonna say, who do you think drinks all the alcohol in the house? Not me, I swear. I swear I'm innocent. Okay, we'll see. I'm gonna put a camera on that. Dad, do you know what your name is? My name? Suegro. Suegro. You're my suegro. Who's suegro? You're my father-in-law. Oh, they call so, suegro? Suegro and suegra. All right, I'm the suegro, baby. 